Hi, my name's McKenna and I own a business called Kenna's Daisies where I sell jewelry and today I am going to be bringing you along with me for my fall restock and doing a little bit of a small business vlog. So let's get to it. It's kind of dark outside, but our first step is to organize our to-do list and so then we will know everything I want to do for this restock. So let me just, oh, oh, just let me, oh, it's done. Nice. It's also bright outside now. <laughs> so I have my whole list of things I need to do. Um, first, I need to make my Halloween jewelry. Then I'm going to work on my promotion, which I will tell you more about, but it's going to be called Freebie Fall, so that's kind of fun. And then I'm going to do some product photography, uh, do some social media planning, and make my Etsy listings. These are not necessarily in order because at first I have to go shopping and get supplies. Okay, I'm back from shopping. I tried to film some stuff there, but it didn't end up working out because my camera said it was recording, but it wasn't. But I bought this nice wood backward uh, background paper and these pumpkins for photos. And then I bought more floss because... you know, why not? <laughs> I need more for all my bracelets I'm going to be making. And then I bought these cute little um, bottles, and I'm going to be making witch potion necklaces, um, and so that's super exciting. Okay, now probably the most important part is actually making the jewelry, um, and while I do, I'm going to tell you about the promotion I'm doing, um, that I'm going to end up making all of my, like, little flyers for and everything, so I thought I would tell you while I'm making this, so we kind of, you know, stay organized. Um, you gotta look at all these cute charms. I'm so obsessed with them. And I'm so excited to do this release. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to tell you about my freebie fall promotion I'm doing. Basically, I am going to offer a freebie with every single purchase that um, people make on Etsy. So, I'll make a giant box during this video um, of just like little freebies that I can give out and then on each order I'll just randomly pick a freebie and put it in with the order and so that <laughs> will be super fun. I'm trying to figure out if I should do multiple freebies for bigger orders or something like that but anyways it'll be a good way to just add a little bit more fun to my fall collection because I feel like fall collections are already so much fun because um, I love like Halloween jewelry. I think it's so fun and obviously that comes with um, doing a fall release in a jewelry shop with all the Halloween jewelry. Um, I'm so excited to make the witch potions. Um, I'm trying to figure out if I'm going to make that a tutorial. I'm going to do a tutorial of it but I'm doing like I'm gonna make little eyeballs out of clay and put them in the um, bottles along with um, some super glue or resin um, and sparkles, obviously. So much glitter, you already know. Um, <laughs> anyways, I'm also going to use some gel nail polish to add red to the tips of these. I'm gonna go get that. So my plan is to take this red. Um, I did this last year for Halloween too, but I sold out of all the ones that I painted. Um, and just like heavily put that gel on there and the gels actually like stay on here like when they're on your nails They peel and stuff, but I wore these earrings like every day for like a month one time and the um, gel like did not come off so I Also haven't heard anyone who bought one tell me that the gel came off So that is good and once I figure out this light just do that to all of them. So I feel like I need to do a pan with like scary music. And the spooky light turned off. So while these are curing, I'm going to start on the photography for the rest of these. Like I said before, I got these little pumpkins. So oh, I don't have a tripod over here. I'm just going to open these and I'm going to place them along the paper. So this is the setup I'm kind of thinking right now. Um, I'm going to like play with some and we will see what we end up with. This is what we ended up with. Um, I think it turned out cute. As you can see, I'm kind of a mess and I jump back and forth a lot um, in this process, but I'm going to clean this up and then we're going to work on some 
of the promotion stuff. I'm going to make a little flyer to put with all the freebies and then we're going to start making stuff for the freebie bucket. So I'm using Canva. Um, this is not sponsored, but Canva saved me so many times. Um, I have a free student account, but this um, is the one I'm going to go off of. I think I'm going to like lighten up the background a little bit and change this, but we will see how that goes. I'm going to like make a safe freebie fall and then add a little bit of information and then I'll probably shrink them down and have them printed. Okay, after a lot of trial and error on Canva, I'm almost finished with my little printout that I'm going to be getting printed out. I have my final product. I will show it to you in real life in just a moment. Look how beautiful it is! Okay, I'm gonna get these cut out. has been added to the pile. Sorry, I'm holding a charger. Um, so now I have all my packaging stuff right there. So this is the bucket I've chosen to fill with freebie stuff. I'm going to make a separate video and put all of that, fill this up with freebies. I have one in there right now, but I will make that a video. So I'll put that in the description when it's done and make a community post about it when I get it up. So look out for that. Okay, so I decided for now that I need to just at least prepare the listings. So when I am filling out the Etsy thing for shipping, it like asks for the weight and size. So I have basically all the stuff. This is a pretty even weight for all the freebies I'll be doing. And so I'm just putting that with all the cards and this. And then I will add them to the scale. And I also need to add the earrings that I am listing. So here we are. So right there. And put all that on here. So it looks like this is, you can't see it, but 59 ounces. So I'm not going to go over the whole process on how to add a new listing, but basically I have to add a picture. So I will be adding one of those. Um, we'll do these brain ones. And then I need to title it and fill out all this information. So, yeah. And there they are. Look how beautiful they are. So, now that I have these done, I'm going to wrap up this video. Thank you so much for joining me for today's video with the vlog. Um, if you want a part two, let me know. But that's pretty much my whole process for the restock. I am going to make the video on filling up the freebie bucket and then maybe a packing orders um, video depending on how many we get. So I will see you guys later and thanks for watching.